All right, guys, I'm sorry. I always forget to bring the screw for this stabilizer right here. So this video might be a little wobbly for the first little bit, but uh, we're in the Salt Lake City Airport um, in my Miles Foot shirt and blue London shorts because I just did some Zumba with my friends. It was hilarious. Um, I'm pretty sure I looked horrible the entire time, but uh, super fun. And we're going to Colorado to get the IT band surgery. I also did a quick little run today to see if maybe something had changed. My IT band was better from some massage therapy I just did. And the scary thing was is it actually was a little bit better, but my surgery is literally tomorrow, so I can't like just not get it. So um, it was a little bit better. It wasn't fixed though, so I'm gonna do, do another run tomorrow. And if it's a lot better, then I'm not gonna get the surgery. Uh, which is a lot of stress, honestly, because it's it's really it's well, it's not going to be a lot better. But if it's significantly better enough that I want to not get the surgery, that's what I'll do. Today I ran about two minutes longer than I normally can without pain, which is believe it or not, big improvement. Um, so yeah, we'll see what happens. I'm a little nervous. I honestly at this point just like want it to hurt because I don't want to like back out of the surgery. And the surgery is minimally invasive, uh, but it should be good. And it's been a long time since I've been able to run. If I don't get the surgery, I have to sit out another, or I have to wait another six weeks until I can get surgery if I postpone it. Uh, so I don't want to bank on massage therapy that much when I've tried so many other things. Um, but really excited to go to Colorado for a day and uh, hang out with my dad. My dad's a surgeon, so he's not going to do the surgery, but he's kind of helped me through the process. And um, really excited to get some food at this place too. Yeah. Ah, it's, it's a tough decision, but I think I think I should do the surgery. Honestly, at this point, it's way more of a risk to not do the surgery than. That, to do that's it. what I think. Does he feel really confident that they're not going to mess up your knee? Yeah, yeah, he feels really confident. Super, super confident. And you know, Dad, he's not. He doesn't well, sugarcoat no. things, so. Say another prayer. Make sure you feel good about it. I feel, you know oh. what? Talking to your dad, I feel pretty darn good about it. Okay. I just think sometimes you have to live your life going, what what would happen? Like if something messes, if something gets messed up and you never get better, you know you did every single thing that you could do to have your senior year cross country season. It wasn't meant to be. It just like if if you don't heal from this, you find you find something else. You know, if you don't do this surgery and you're not healed in four weeks, you've lost your cross country season. I think it's gonna work, Easton. Anxiety stuff first, or am I gonna need that? Dad? <laughs> you gonna hit him on the head? He might cry a little bit, but I think he'll survive. Oh gosh! Oh well, just just now I didn't. I think I didn't. All right, guys, I've got the cool outfit on. That means I'm ready to go. A little nervous. They're not putting me to sleep for this one, despite me trying to talk him into it. So yeah. hopefully that means I can get some video. I've got. I think I'm gonna have to also talk him into that. I don't think they'll let me, but we're gonna try. I am going to commit a huge crime real quick and come in two days later um, because my camera got all blurry after the surgery and so I didn't get any good footage. Um, but the surgery went well. They pulled out what they think was the problem. It was like a burst underneath my IT band that was just driving me crazy and giving me pain and they pulled it out. So they think that they fixed it. I really hope so. Going into the surgery, it was like an 80% chance of success and it doesn't hurt at all. I actually like froze it with too much ice. So like I really cannot feel anything in my knee and I haven't been able to 
um, since the surgery. But yeah, here's what it looks two days later. It's a little ugly and swollen, but hey, to all those haters who said I could never be thick, look at that. Hey guys, um, so it's so it's me, and um, Easton's like just got done with the surgery. You want to say hi to the vlog? Hi. <laughs> so I'm gonna be vlogging his experience. So yeah. Penny. Difficulty with activation, try Viagra. Oh, I read that wrong. <laughs> try Viagra. <laughs> no, if you experience difficulty with activation, rotate the pack 90 degrees and back. Oh, yeah, it's not, it doesn't say Viagra. <laughs> Repeat the above instructions. Knee cut open. Yeah. And so he's stuck in bed. Yeah. So I have to go. I just went behind some Mike, ice because I'm such Mike. a nice person. Mike. Wait, I need to go get you some ice first. So let's go get some ice. I don't know. Knee! It's for Easton. What for you doing? That's for my knee. That's for my knee. My knee's doing some surgery. That's gonna be so He shit. developed an accent. Yeah. What accent is that? Is that Irish? English? It fluctuates. It's it fluctuates. A, I think it's a mix of a couple of different ones, but it, 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 it works. So yeah, 